guys, welcome back once again. It is me, Mold. So happy to be here with you guys today because we are doing something a little weird and fun. We are going to be doing King versus Queen. Now, here's one thing that obviously is going to make this a little different. My Queen is level 20, my King is level 17, all right? But what I'm going to do is find two similar bases. I guess for the King, I might find one that's a little bit easier. Um, but I'm going to try and find like Town Hall 8 bases and we're going to see the percentages that the king and the queen can get, all right? So uh, we've got a whole bunch of healers and one little wall breaker. So we've got 17 healers and one wall breaker. Let's go ahead and attack with the queen first and see what we can find. So I'm going to be looking for Town Hall 8 uh, like this one, and we are going to see how well we can do so. Where are his, all right, so he's got that one air defense right there, so we are going to take out this air defense right here, and uh, I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I forgot that it takes three. I was thinking of mortar. All right, it's okay. We're going to do fine. So we are going to drop off our queen right here, and we are going to let her get to work <coughs> on this base. Um, did you see that? The wall breaker uh, did damage to... Uh, dang it, I thought the wall breaker was going to get inside. Alright, Queen, come on. Take out that air defense so I can drop off some some uh, healers on you. Take it out. There you go. Good girl. Alright, so we've got two and a half minutes left. Now we're going to drop off a couple of healers, and we're going to get her in through the wall, and then we're going to drop a jump spell right here as well. And she is just going to get healed up. I'm going to save some healers for her. Um, the king's just staring at her like, what the freak is going, look at him, he's like, WTF? Look at him, he's still just looking at her. <laughs> Wait, is she getting healed? I don't know if I want to mess with her. Come on, queen. Wow, look at that, he does big hits. It's so crazy, I don't get it. Alright, so she is still just going to continue working her way around the base. I'm going to go ahead and use her ability so we can get some more DPS because we need these archers out here. Uh, to help, but it didn't look like any of the healers wanted to heal them up. So we are down now, and she, now that jump spell is gone, we're going to go ahead and jump right here and see if we can get her over there. So she can take out this air defense right here. Take out, what are you doing? That was weird. You see that little stutter step she did? All right, so there's one air, there's another air defense down. We've got a minute left. No, queen, this, okay, good. Yes, go through the jump spell. Good girl. All right, so she's going to head over there. We might even be able to get rid of all three of these air defenses without any of our healers being touched. Um, so she's going to head over to that gold mine. Let's see if she can get into the center and take out this... Uh, nope, there goes the bomb. <laughs> no, queen, go, go to the air defense. Air defense, air defense, air defense queen. We're going to go ahead and just drop off the rest of our healers and get them in there because all of the air defenses are down now and she is in the center. Queen, go for the town hall. Yes, yeah, she's going for the town hall now. She is definitely going to get it. Maybe we can get a 50% with the town hall. Um, she is completely at full health, no issues. Obviously, we're not gonna get that much loot from this, but it is kind of funny. Um, I just realized that my mic was a little off to the side. Uh, I got this boom arm for it, so it's, I don't know, out of my way now. Um, come on, queen, we gotta get 50%. Let's go, let's go, queen. She's at full health. It's so hilarious. I'm going to save that jump spell for the king so we don't have to um, get that up. Come on, queen. Come on, queen. Get 50%, please. Yes, 50%. Two star with the queen. We're going to see what percentage she ends up at. And she is going to be at full health, guys, which is so hilarious to me. 53, she's not going to get that. So 53%. Um, oh, no, she's not at full health. <laughs> I bet it's going to be like a five minute wait time or something. All right, so that was awesome. She did pretty good. Uh, yeah, two minutes left. So uh, she got 53%, 13 trophies. All right, not too shabby, not too shabby queen. And I'm going to go ahead and get these healers up and ready. And then I will uh, be back with you guys once we find a base that we think our... Uh, oh, shoot. If I need... <clears throat> I got I got to bring three of them, which sucks. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get all these things up, and we will be back once I find a base for the king to attack. All right, so hold on tight, guys. All right, guys, we are back, and we have found a base. Uh, my recorder froze while I was attacking this live, so you guys are going to get to see this again. This base has really, really good loot. 
I was considering popping my King's ability right here just so that I could get all of the loot and the gold, but I had to save it um, if I wanted to get as much percentage as possible. So uh, we start off down here, and I've got all the healers except for five of them on him right now. Thankfully, the bottom portion of this base, after I took out that air defense, has no coverage of air defense whatsoever. Um, so that's one reason why I picked it now. I do think this base was about the same difficulty as the one for the queen, and you guys are going to see how well the king does. Um, I do, however, wish that the healers would switch over to um, to the barbarians that come out, just like with the archer queen. The healers didn't jump out to the archers that came out, so that was a little bit um, annoying. But the king's going to work his way over the left side here, taking out all of this elixir, which is going to help pay for all of the... Uh, healers that we have trained up. He's going to continue doing just a little amount of damage. I wish that he did more. Um, I feel like he's not even as tanky as he's supposed to be um, because he seems to take a lot of damage. But we're going to drop that jump spell right there. We're going to get the king up in here. I'm surprised that that Tesla is just now um, popping up uh, because it looked like he was closer or at least close enough to bring it out. But he's going to jump in there toward the Tesla, do some work on it. You can see that our healers actually are taking some group damage from that wizard tower. Uh, but it's okay because the wizard tower is low enough that it's not doing anything. Um, do the... Uh no, they don't. All right, so the king's going to keep working his way around. We're going to drop that jump spell right there so that the king can get up into the center of the base. And then we're going to pop his ability right here. And this is what I'm talking about. So we have all of these healers, and none of them feel like healing up the barbarians. So it's kind of annoying. I mean, they're healing the ones up that are next to the king. But, like, right now, I wish that just maybe two of them would pop off and heal the rest. But they're just going to keep doing their own thing. Uh, thankfully, this cannon right here is being an idiot. And look at it. It's shooting directly over to the king through the walls. Look, you can see it disappearing as it shoots through the walls. But now it has changed its target. And the king, guys, is on the town hall. We've got 25 seconds left. And the king is on the town hall. We already used his ability. He's up at 41%. So the queen got 53%. It's going to be so freaking close. But I don't think that we are going to be able to get it. In fact, I already know that we're not going to be able to get it. Um, I should have dropped my queen down over here just to take out that gold for, uh, for farming's sake. But we're just going to let the king continue doing work in the middle. He's going to try and take out that gold storage, but he is not going to be able to. So the victorious winner is the queen when it comes to percentage and trophies. But the king, on the other hand, he's bringing home that money. He's bringing home that gold and that elixir uh, for the base. So um, there you have it, guys. The winner is the queen, <clears throat> which we all probably could have guessed because she does a lot more damage. Let's go look at those facts, actually. So she does 255 damage per second and has 1076 hit points. Um, he only does 164. Uh, so she's killing him in the damage department. So he does 164. She does 255. Uh, his health point, his hit points are so much higher, but I feel like he takes a lot of damage. But it's okay. Because he's our king, and he rules our base, and we love him. But that's going to be it for this random episode, guys. I hope that you all enjoyed King vs. Queen. Maybe we'll figure out some other ways to do King vs. Queen um, and see, I don't know, how well they work or how long it takes them to destroy something. Maybe once we get our king up to level 20. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And as always, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace!